Hello, this is a quick introduction and explanation for Timecode. Do you use Camtasia to create videos for YouTube and Microsoft Stream? Well, if you do, then you probably want to be using timestamps to help your users find you and your content. And our little Timecode application can help you quickly and easily generate those timestamps from your Camtasia video file. The Timecode application will create a text file of the timestamps that you can copy and paste directly into your description for your YouTube videos or Microsoft Stream Classic videos to instantly create hyperlinked timestamps for your users. The timecode application also automatically inserts the secret element that is required to trigger YouTube to turn your timestamps into chapters. So let's get started and see how this works. First, simply take the application and put it in the same folder as your Camtasia project file which will be a .tscproj file, and then start the application. Next, you select the options that you want. For Camtasia, you have timeline markers and track markers, and so you may, for instance, use the track markers for the internal video editing, and the timeline markers would be used for clickable links and chapters, so you can select to only get the timestamps for one or the other or both. This last option is necessary if you want to trigger YouTube to turn your timestamps into chapter markers for your video. And then you click Process. And you see here's the text file and the timestamps all ready for you to copy and paste into your YouTube description or Microsoft Stream Classic description. So you take the timestamps and you copy them and paste them into the video description. Okay, you can see here we pasted it into the YouTube video description and you click save and then here's the video without the timeline markers and the chapters and we added them in so now we can refresh and we'll see the timestamps and the chapters. There you can see the chapters and here's the timestamps and these are clickable so you can click on those and they'll go directly to that point in the video but more importantly chapters have been added based on those timestamps. Here's something, I'm gonna show you a way now that you can get those timestamps automatically generated without needing our little application. Within Camtasia, you can export directly to YouTube and you'll need to log in, but then whenever you upload a video, you simply check this box, create table of contents from markers, and it'll create that table of contents from all of your markers in your video. So if that's good enough for you, then you don't need our application. The reason we created the application, though, is because this doesn't always work for us and there have been problems in the past and it's not completely consistent. And also, we don't necessarily always want to have to produce the video directly into YouTube. We like to produce the video separately and upload it into YouTube separately. And so we need to be able to create the time code separately and you might have the same desire. Also, if you've got prior videos that you've uploaded already to YouTube and you want to easily add the timestamps, you can get our little application and go back through your Camtasia project files and generate those timestamp files quickly and easily and add them to older YouTube videos. So there you have it. Time code is a simple little application that can help you quickly and easily generate timeline markers or track markers from your Camtasia video files to add clickable hyperlinks and chapter markers to your YouTube videos or to your Microsoft Stream Classic videos. Also, please check in the video description because we've compiled a list of some of the best videos we were able to find on YouTube talking about the value of timestamps in the video descriptions. And hopefully it will help you understand the value of timestamps in video descriptions. And you might even be exposed to some new experts in video creation who can help you take all of your work to the next level. We hope this helped you and thank you very much.